we check gas pressure, but yeah, clocking meters is because uh, it doesn't equate to everything out there. If a protocol covers all equipment, fine. But if it's only specific to one, we don't usually include it. I have a feeling uh, Jim Bergman's going to have a different take. I just want to know if you never clock the meter, Jim, how do you know they're off by 10%? Gas company. I'm on the other side of the fence on that because single set of instruction you get from any manufacturer will tell you that you need to clock the meter. Now, there's a couple nuances to it. Jim's right about a, a lot of the things he's talking about is you don't know the heat content in any one minute, which is exactly why you need to clock the meter. Because if you're tuning it with a combustion analyzer and you don't know whether the heat content's high or the heat content's low. If the heat content is low in the gas and you tweak the oxygen and get it on the threshold, now the heat content goes high, the whole combustion can change. We set an appliance up for average heat content. If you go to the EGA website, they'll tell you the average heat content of gas over the year probably stays within about 5%, but it, it does fluctuate. If literally minute to minute,